Hello Sweet Souls, it's Friday, November 18th. And I know you guys like the um, two a days, the second reading. So I'm gonna do a really quick reading for you guys. Uh, we're gonna call on St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender. Anyone sending a will through thought, word, or action toward myself, the viewer, we're gonna call on the Holy Spirit, angel saints, and spirit guides, and ask for a message for our greater good. So let's see what they want you to know or what they want you to focus on, okay? Let's see. What do they need to know? What do they need to know? What do they need to know? Oh, okay, you guys. So you may be getting communication um, from someone that wants to give you an offer. The problem I see here is the divine is asking you to keep your guard up with this person. Defend yourself, okay? You're in the energy of the sun, happiness, peace, contentment. And I get that the energy of this person that's coming in to bring an offer is not going to bring peace and contentment. Yeah, because justice is being served. This has been coming out. So the scales are being balanced. And whoever this is that wants to come in and give an offer, they are reaping their, their justice. And so now they're coming to you. Protect your peace at all costs is what I'm hearing. Protect your peace. Anything else they need to know? Yeah. You know, they're saying review the past with compassion and forgiveness. Heal and head in a new direction. You are heading in a new direction. Not to past offers. Um, you're going someplace where past people cannot go with you. They can't go with you. Okay? You're being blessed. Okay? You're being blessed. And this blessing is meant for you. Yeah, look at this. Release. What did I say? They can't come with you. Release them. This can be family. This can be friends. This can be ex-loves. It's time to let them go. Okay? Yeah, they're still in devil energy. These people are still stuck in their ego, self-serving. You know, if they didn't see your value in the past, I don't care who it is. Family, friends, ex-loves, they're not going to see your value now. They just want to want to hold on to you because they can see your your uh, glow up. They can see your rising. They can see you don't care and you're not tolerating BS anymore. That's what they can see. Anything else? What else they need to know? Thank you. Yeah, balance is being restored in your life in every aspect. I'm talking peace, contentment, love, uh, financial security. Everything is balancing out for you. Yeah, they said make plans for the future and dream big because there's so much abundance headed your way, so much success headed your way, that you have no idea. Go ahead and plan for the future and let them watch. Let them watch. This is part of their lesson for mistreating you, for, for devaluing you. You're about to be recognized for all that you do. All the amazing things that you do is about to be recognized, okay? People will see you for who you truly are. Again, you're about to be recognized. And yeah, past people are going to be in heavy regret, heavy regret. But that's part of their karmic lesson. That's the way that they, um, God is trying to force them. I just said God. God is trying to force them to change, change who they are, be accountable, and to raise their vibration, get rid of toxic people out of their life, change their toxic patterns. Yeah, these are people that love third parties. And now they're heavily burdened because their third party options only gave them burdens. And that is not your problem. It's not your problem, guys. They want you to release this person, these people. Release them. You're the Empress. The Empress could never be in a third party situation. The Empress is end all, be all. The Empress is abundant, magnetic, loving, nurturing. She is a master manifester. A true soulmate entering your life if they haven't already you'll fall in love with someone that will give equally to you they will be your other half right someone that will be honest and loyal someone that will be their true authentic self just like you could be a Libra Gemini Aquarius it doesn't have to be guys it's just the energy Yeah, lower vibrational energies that want to rush in is a joke. That is a joke because you know how powerful and amazing you are. They already put you through so much hell and now they want to come back in. 
No, you're in the energy of learning new things. Moving forward in your life, learning new things that bring you so much happiness. Emotional fulfillment is yours. God promises it is yours. You're amazing. Look at this. Queen of Swords to the Ten of Pentacles. You cut people out and you leave them out. You are laser focused on generational wealth, building a stable foundation with a divine partner, which is, again, here we have the King and Queen of Swords. Both honest, both kind, both loyal. Okay? I don't know where it is. It's in there. You guys remember it. And, you know, people being obsessed and upset by how they treated you and how your life is coming together so amazing, that is not your problem or concern. This is the universe um, giving them their karma so that they will learn their lesson. They were given a chance just like you were. You're moving on into peace. A lot of peace. For some, for some of you, you're traveling and it's coming in quick. That's fast action. A lot of passion too, moving forward. Being very passionate about things. Anything else? Wow, that was a lot. Yeah. Oh, loving yourself. You now love yourself, know your value and worth. You remember what this, these past people did to try to destroy you, to leave you out in the cold, to reject or abandon you, or to withhold finances to try to destroy you. And them coming in with an emotional offer, you're the high priestess. You don't need to be told twice. You don't need to be shown twice the true intent of, of a, an energy. You know them. You can read their energy. You know every word they ever spoke. You know every tear you ever cried. You've forgiven them. You've released them. But you're not a fool. And you're not going to accept it, them back, okay? So let's do some angel answers, guys. You can think of a yes or no question. Um, but let's just see what comes out. What do they need to know? What did I tell you? Success. Success is yours. Because there is something better all along. The universe, God, creator, they saw that this, these people were not meant to be in your life. Okay? And divine timing. Success is yours. Yeah. God is also bringing not only the angel saints and your spirit guides, your ancestors, but people in the 3D realm that are going to be in alignment with you. They're going to help you. Okay? Uh-oh. Oh, no. It went in the water. Yeah. Peace returning into your life. So much peace returning into your life. Yeah, choosing a new direction. For some of you, you will be called to physically change locations. You will be moving, relocating, okay? Just trust, all right? There is no need for you to worry. Also, if you had a yes or no question, the answer is no. Anything else? They're saying opportunities are coming. New opportunities are headed your way. Uh, there's going to be big changes within a year from now. Your life will look completely different. Call on the angels. Ask them to guide you. They will. They'll give you the inspired action that you need to take. This, your situation will improve. Everything about your life is about to improve. Yep. Again, a hard no. Stop worrying, guys. Big happy changes are headed your way. Use your voice. Speak your truth. Be your true authentic self. Set boundaries with others, okay? All right, guys. I love you. I hope you have an absolute amazing day. Bye-bye.